Hello and welcome. My name is Kashyap Jagannatha. I am a lead support engineer with Informatica Global Customer Support. Today, I want to demonstrate how we can configure a pervasive database connection from Informatica. The steps would be how we will configure DSN through ODBC, the environment variables, do a test connection and then create this connection from admin console. In order to configure a pervasive database connection, first we need to install the pervasive client on the server machine. So here is the client home directory if you see. This is the structure, directory structure where you can see the bin, the libraries, the etc. etc has the default odbc.ini. So the underlying uh, interface would be through odbc. That's how we connect to pervasive from Informatica server. So if I let me show you the odbc.ini. So here is a sample DSN pervasive demo test. This is the driver installed I mean, from the client. And then uh, I just used a demo database and this is the server name and port number. I mean, we need to make sure this port is accessible. Uh, you then that's pretty much so with this information using this TSN we should be able to connect to that uh, pervasive database from Informatica let us uh, do a test connection let us try to create a connection and do a test connection from uh, Informatica admin console here I am in the connections let me create a connection it's an ODBC connection pervasive I can give any username and password it doesn't need a username then the TSN so test connection it says uh, interface cannot access the data source is not running at the specified port I mean this I just want to show how this particular database is uh, let me just uh, quickly show you the pervasive DB so here is the pervasive control center where you can see the services and then this is my database server so let me start the services I've installed this database on my windows machine so once I start the services uh, if you see in the databases so this is the demo data database which I'm trying to connect from Informatica where it has some tables here so now 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 that i have uh, you know created i uh, have started the services uh, let me try to test the connectivity from the admin console i'm back here in the admin console test connection mm -hmm. so the connectivity is successful so let me show you the environment variables that i have configured for this pervasive database So this is the source wherein all you need to configure is the path. So this is the client directory as I showed earlier, psql bin and then ld library path we need to give that lib64 and then odbc ini, odbc home and then ld library path. So these are the environment variables that you need in order to make a successful connection to the pervasive database. For further references, you can refer to uh, pervasive documentation. We would also come up with a KB article which will show how to configure a connection to pervasive database. Thank you for watching this video. We would love to hear from you. For any feedback, please feel free to tweet us at InfaSupport or you can even email us at supportvideos at Thank you. Have a nice time.